What up my freaks, Ruinous Insight here with part 30 of my Battletech Heavy Metal Iron Man career mode let's play. As we saw last time, the contracts remaining in non-diz saw us take some damage and some injuries. With Martyr and Snowbound, both our top two characters I believe out of the action, in addition to some of our mechs, we are not in a particularly good place, especially considering the uh, last two of the contracts here are both for skull contracts. I don't think we have had too much experience with four skulls, especially considering we have no assault mechs to rely on, just heavies. Now, I still want to try them. It'll be dangerous and we won't have our main characters, but I do want to try them. However, we will wait here six days. We do need the Marauder if we want to do this. Why do we need the Marauder? I do believe it's because they're four skull missions, and four skulls might mean good salvage, and good salvage means we'll want to have some head hits. Marauder, you're the best for that, so we're going to waste the six days to try to get you on the team. Now, before we jump into the first contract, I just want to quickly mention that it'll be the first and only contract, simply because as uh, I have made an announcement on the uh, community tab, whatever the hell it's called, I will be out and away from my PC for the next little while, so I have pre-recorded the next number of episodes, which will thus most likely only be single battle episodes, simply because I don't have time, a little bit of a reduced schedule, and all of that. As soon as I get back to my PC, of course, following my travels, everything will be back to normal. In the meantime, oh, notice all these uh, little tiny accents on you. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Anyway, as I was saying, let's get to waiting for those six days and let's get to the single contract. Oh, of course, it's a super short contract. Ye My spirits, thank you for your willingness to take on challenging tasks. You're making a valuable contribution, blah, 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 blah. Faction reputation status update. Isn't that sweet? I don't see what changed just now. We were already friendly from last time, or maybe you had to wait a day before it... Uh, it activated that. Anyway, let's go back to contracts. Does that change anything? It doesn't look like it. There are no more missions of this type here. Anyway, keep going. Wait for that Marauder to come back up and... You are. Yes, sure. We are at normal. We could go for generous. We could go sell some mechs and go for generous. You know what? I think it's time. I think it's time. There we go. Work on Grasshopper complete. Yes, Marauder. Two more. And there we have it. There we have it. Time for contract. Now, I assume it's all going to be desert because it's nothing but desert everywhere here. Mech factories. Oh, they're both capture bases. Interesting. All right. We picked up a coded transmission from the surface of non-Diz. Daddy and Scouts report a previously unknown manufacturing plant has been activated by Capellan forces, and they're broadcasting what we believe might be pre-war blueprints to an unknown recipient somewhere in the system. We need you to move in and capture that facility intact and protect it while we mobilize the garrison. Oh, God damn it! we have to protect it as well? Oh, that's definitely going to take a long time. That's going to be difficult against uh, four skulls. <laughs> All right, let's see what we can do here, shall we? Uh, four and 420, I think. Yeah, we're going to have to be real careful. If we're getting annihilated, we might have to run. We very well might have to run. Now, who do we bring? Who do we bring here? I guess we could still take the catapult. Uh, damn. How do we do this? Marauder, you need to be in here. That's one thing that I'm sure about. Hmm. Very low heat efficiency on the archer. But that's okay. The buck sh Buckshot can handle the archer. I think we need two tanks. I think we'll take out the catapult, unfortunately. That'll reduce our firepower fairly significantly as the uh, Marauder doesn't do crazy amounts of damage and at least, and it can't hit everything with its missiles like the catapult can. But if there's a nice salvage, we gotta take it. Of course, we could give the Marauder to somebody here. Hmm. What if we don't take the Thunderbolt? The thing is, the Thunderbolt has pretty crazy amounts of firepower as well. Uh, but then we would be able to bring the Catapult. But you know what? No, I think it's fine. I think it's fine as it is. Uh, if, let's say... I mean, the Marauder actually has a fairly decent chunk of armor. It's actually more heavily armored than the Thunderbolt, so it can off-tank in a pinch. Whereas the Thunderbolt, despite being able to do insanity amounts of damage, can't do that as well. Especially considering it doesn't even have Bulwark. 
You know what? You're probably not the proper pilot for that thing. Uh, let's get you either the catapult, and let's go like that. We could also bring Galmaraz, but the thing is, it's desert area. Although the Galmaraz runs fairly hot, cool. Hmm. Ah, but you don't have Bulwark. I'm not really willing to have it hurt again. Plus, Martyr, you're the only real pilot of Galmaraz. I think we can all agree on that. Alright, let's do it without Gal. Well, let's do it. Well, let's see how this works out, shall we? Kind of worried about the whole base defend thing. And of course the fact that it's a four skull, that's, I'm pretty sure that we're guaranteed to see enemy assault mechs, considering we don't have a single assault me mech to uh, absorb hits ourselves, might be dangerous. I do wonder whether we can get turrets up, although since we don't start with the base, I imagine that we won't. There's a lot of calm chatter coming from the fact that let's move to get a good observation point, blah blah blah, move in, take it. Alrighty, so you. You're gonna rush forward right here. Why did you stop? Go here. Archer, up over here. You guys forward and forward. Enemy contacts are in. Ooh, 80 ton, 90 ton, 60 ton. Uh, you guys are gonna stay up here and stay away. There we are. Dragon. You are going to jump up right here. Like so. Roger. Then you are going to identify the 80 tonner because it hasn't moved yet. It's an awesome. Okay, lots of PPCs, but it means it won't cool down very well. And we got an 85 tonner. Immediately identifies the catapult who doesn't have a lot of evasion. Hey. But that's not so good for us. Uh, you stay where you are for now. Just fire on that awesome. A little bit of free hits in there. It doesn't have a lot of armor, so we can break it apart pretty quickly if we get a lot of shots. And especially if it can't see us, it can fire on the rotter, but it can't hit it. Too many evasion pips for you. Alright, let's see. You. Commander. You can move in right here, get three evasion pips and fire on the awesome. In fact, I'd rather you move here. There you go, Orion. I would like to get you into cover ASAP, but we don't have good cover. All we can do is rely on our evasion right now. Break apart this awesome as fast as we possibly can, please. Oh, we got a Cyclops over here. Now it's got a fair amount of weaponry. You're going to need to move back, Catapult, or move up here at the very least. Reduce their ability to actually damage you. You, Marauder. You're going to stand right beside this guy. Uh, I think maybe you're better off doing this instead. A little bit less on the evasive side. Although you do more damage here. But I would rather break... Ah, I don't want to hit it in the arm, though. That's the thing. You move here first, I think. Yeah. Yeah, plus we got Precision Strike on you. We won't be using it on the awesome, obviously. Really, no CT hits? Not one CT hit. Not as good as I'd like. What are you? Uh, we got a quick draw. Okay, okay, you're not... You have a lot of weapons, but you also run very hot for a desert biome. Uh, Dragon, you're going to go all the way up here. Oh, he can see you directly. You know what? You're going to hide behind this thing instead, though. Go right there. Fire everything at the awesome. Try to break apart that torso. We need this thing gone. There we go, left torso destroyed, and that's one PPC down. Battlemaster? Okay. Uh, we need to go hide behind this hill here. They're going to strip our armor way too fast, considering we don't have anything to hide behind. And this is only the first lance that we're dealing with. Ready for orders. There will be more. So you, you're going to back away, right here. Coordinates received. Fire everything at the awesome. That should make it fall down, I think. Right, right, fall down. No, it didn't fall. Okay, that's not good. And it is kind of... Hmm. Can we break it apart from here? Maybe, maybe not. Let's try. Let's try. It is braced and guarded and entrenched. Will these things only do one damage? Let's find out. Yeah, they're only going to do one damage. And they're all hitting the arm on top of that. I shouldn't have done that. Damn. Cyclops, you managed to hit the Orion still. Damn. Okay. Minimal damage Wait, who the hell is spotting the Orion from here? How can they see him? Waiting That's a little you. strange. Uh, you. I worry about you, but... Hmm. We can't hit the Battlemaster in the face from here, can we? Doesn't look like it. Does not look like it. Fine. 
Uh, we could actually reserve you. Let's see what they do here. Ah, no dice. No dice on that. Then the, you're going to do the only thing you can do, which is move as far away as possible. Which is here, I suppose. And fire on the awesome. Oh. Uh. Awesome. You have more chances to hit... Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. You could hit the Cyclops in the face from here, actually. It's dangerous. Position confirmed. But... I mean... Wait, wait, you only have 12% chance? What the hell, Marat? It's turned weirdly, is that why? 74% chance. Justice? Why? Mm, I don't know. Alright, well then you're going to fire at the awesome. A little bit more damage. I just want that thing gone. Quick draw's coming in. Gonna fire on the Marauder. Get a little bit of damage in there. Actually, the arm is actually losing armor fairly fast. It's losing armor. Ha 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 ha. Uh, you. Fire on the Quick Draw. Or you know what? No. Fire on the Cyclops, I think. Yeah, this thing's still going to be braced and guarded, and you don't have breaching shot. You know who had breaching shot? Somebody who's injured right now. Alright, here comes the Battlemaster. I've been sent to lock. Yes, you have. Okay, let's see. How are we gonna do this? Marauder, you. We could try to hide, actually. It'd be better to try. If you sprint, let's say, right here, you will be pretty much hidden. Double time. And then they can't see it. The Awesome will still be able to see the Orion. And it's gonna fire. Ooh, okay. okay. Both are hit, and they both hit the same area. Damn it. Okay, we need to kill that thing. You. Move away, let's say, right here. Present your left arm only. Roger. Just fire the AC-5. Probably not going to kill it. Although, it might. Try it. Ah, it did. Good job. Go, go, go. Target neutralized. Alright, that's one down. And at least you're gonna sink your heat off of that. You are going to fire on the catapult. Damn that indirect fire. Alright, we're gonna have to identify somebody and kill him. The quick draw is probably coming next. Uh, you can't really do anything. Reserve yourself. And... You can't reserve anymore. That's unfortunate. Hmm, what do we do with you? I guess you're just gonna stay where you are. Pointless to do anything. Okay. Alright, our turn now. You. you. You're fine. Uh, move over here and identify... Who do we identify? Probably the quick draw. It's, it's, on the other hand, it's probably going to come close enough to actually attack us. It depends on when it moves, really. You. Fire on the quick draw before it uh, gets any evasion pips. Okay, okay, decent clustering there. That torso piece is just about gone. They're going to keep hitting the catapult with their limited long-range weaponry, but that's not that bad. It's really not that bad. You guys. You, if you move here, you would be able to fire on the quick drop, but then they can fire on you as well. What about you? It fire from here, out of the field, but only your AC-5. I feel like we should reserve. Let him move forward. And what? Did it not? Did it already move this turn? What the hell? Waiting for orders. My bad. Okay, did not realize that. Uh, you. Ugh, if we move here, you're gonna get hit by these threatening folks. I think you're gonna have to brace, and you're gonna have to brace right over here. We're going to win in a, a game of uh, long range attrition, so we might as well play it. Here comes a quick draw. Oh damn, that's a lot of evasion pips. Okay, you. Strip the pips. Damn. That's only going to strip two. Oh, well, what are you gonna do? Got the lock. Better than nothing. You're going to Better find the catapult the again. You. Hey. Move right here. Or, uh, somewhere where the shot isn't obscured. Right here. Advancing. Fire on the quick draw, 60% chance hit, not great, but it is something. There we go, at least that worked out. And a lot of its threat is now gone, lost evasive on top of it. 
Uh, you, you're gonna fire on the Rotter and get a stray shot at the Orion. Keep wanting to call the Orion the Oreo. Uh, you. Yes, Commander. This video not sponsored by Oreos. Uh, you. Just fire the AC-5, I guess. If they don't want to move in, then why would we, uh, why would we oblige them? Go here. Location confirmed. Fire. Copy that. A little bit of damage. That CT should break fairly soon, as long as we keep, uh, getting hits in. Move in. That's going to mean another stray shot, most likely, but what can you do? Keep hitting that CT. Oh, we got one leg hit. Oh, did we get a head hit as well? Lucky. A little bit lucky there. You. You're moving in now. Can you attack anybody from here? Does not look like it. You. Identify him again, please. I mean, I guess we have pretty decent positioning in that they can't really do anything. Got a lock on me. But I am pretty terrified of their uh, fire powers, so, what? No. you know, you gotta do what you can do. Uh, you, fire on this guy, please destroy him. Come on, come on, cluster in the CT. Getting there, not quite, but getting there. You firing on the Marauder. I can't take much more of this. Oh, I'm aware. I am Order. plainly aware of this. You, if you go here, you can fire. But you'll probably be close enough for the Battlemaster to fire as well. What if you go like this? Maybe he won't be able to spot. On the other hand, ah, uh, there's no way to hit him in the CT either. So I'll hit him in the arm. But what choice do we have? What choice do we have, Rodder? We need to break this thing down. Do what you can. Oh, wow, you're running real hot now. You might have to, uh, cool down. How are we looking there? A little bit too much, uh, Order. damage spread, alas. You, move here. On my way. Keep firing. Even with the obscured shot, probably worth it. There we go, there we go. This thing has two medium lasers left. I don't want it to come forward and spot. Which is exactly what it's gonna do. It's gonna see everybody now. It's gonna fire its two medium lasers at the Orion. Hopefully, a Dragon, you can Light break damage, it apart. Dragon, fire on this thing. You have a direct line, and it doesn't have a lot of HP. It should die. There we go. CT destroyed a tiny bit of overkill, but I'm pretty happy with that. Mech destroyed. There we go. Battlemaster, here you come. And you are still turned to the side, Great. meaning we can't hit you in the front, can we? You can move into cover here. Probably the best thing to do for you. Go into cover and brace yourself. Brace? Let's see what they do. Cyclops, you're coming in. Okay, that's going to hurt. Oh, that's really going to hurt. We don't have cover for you. We might need to move up here or something. I don't really know what to do about the Cyclops. Hmm, what do you have, by the way? You have Sure Footing, Bulwark, and Ace Pilot. And move after shooting. Alright, fine. Then you do this. Oh, but you can't fire from here? You're not turned perfectly. God damn it, that's not good. Ah, uh, if you move into the mineral field, it'll probably reduce your chances to hit. I have a decent chance to hit the uh, Battlemaster, actually, but... Who's more tanky? Honestly, the Battlemaster is considerably more threatening in terms of weapon loadout. So you're gonna go here into the uh, mineral field. Then you're going to pop Vigilance. Because you got no choice. You're going to fire everything on the Cyclops, even though it's a less percent chance to hit. I'd like to uh, salvage the Battlemaster, therefore I'm going to try to go for headshots. And we're going to try to kill the uh, Cyclops outright. So that's the plan. We'll Thank see if you. it works out. You. Uh, you stay where you are. I think you're fine. There we go. I really need more cover. Here comes the Battlemaster. This is going to be concerning. You're at least in cover, and you have evasion. I'm fairly happy with that. Alright, try to go for those head hits damage now. Minimal. I know. I know, damage is minimal. Uh, Dragon, you are going to keep firing on the Clops. Fairly decent amount of damage there. Uh, you, Provocator. If you go here... Now you'll have a stray shot. What about here? Lots of chances to hit it. Probably the best thing we can do right now. Do this. Pop. How many of these can you fire? 
Pop Vigilance, of course. We are going to lose our bonus after this, but... Locked on. Well, not after this one, but after we uh, use the next one. Cyclops is going to move. Is he going to go for the Orion? Yes, indeed he is. And he's going to use Breaching Shot with an SRM. Kind of a dumb thing to do, in my opinion. Justice. We basically have to do nothing but to try to... Uh, try to headshot you. Risky. Risky, but try it. Go right here. Precision Strike. 12% chance. Where's the 35? You're a Marauder, right? You are indeed a Marauder. You have the Lance Command mod. What are we missing here? Is it because it's a Battlemaster? Does it have some sort of work that reduces our head hit chance? No, 74% only to the CT with the Precision Strike. Not entirely sure why. What if we do it to you? 12% chance. Is it because your gunnery is not high enough? I would assume that was the reason. Alright, well that's unfortunate, but it's all we can do now since we've got you out of cover for this. No dice, no dice, no dice. Yeah, looks like no head hits there. Yeah, and it did no armor damage essentially. That's not good. I think we're going to have to bring out all the stops. You, come forward. Oh wow, your chance to hit is also low. On the Cyclops, really? That's a massive difference. Huh. Go figure. Well, you're gonna have to take a hit. Uh, yeah. Fire on the Battlemaster. Don't fire the medium lasers, obviously. Although you could if you cooled yourself down, but it's not worth it right now. Maybe we'll be able to take out one of its pieces and, uh... Standing by. Something. You, what chance? You have a good chance to hit. I'm not entirely sure why. Is it the mineral field? This guy's not in the mineral field, so I don't know. Whatever. Whatever. Fire on the clubs. Uh, advanced command mod destroyed. Wait, a, oh, you're an HQ. What the hell? I did not realize there was an HQ. Huh. Fascinating. Here you. Moving over here a little bit further away, you have garbage hit chance. You're much better off hitting the uh, the Battlemaster. Aye, aye. What's your chance to hit that head with a precision strike? 18. It's higher than the Marauders. Was it the land? Was it the advanced command mod that was doing this? I don't actually know what was doing this. Uh, fire everything at you, I guess. If we could strip away that piece of, uh... Damn, a lot of its weaponry is tied up here. Quite a lot. If we can break off that torso piece. We can't do it with you. But the, uh, the Marauder should be able to, right? And we just got a couple hits in there, that's okay. Yeah, we got a head hit. That's ironic. Solid connection on that one. Considering we were trying to before and couldn't manage it. You, you're going to fire on the Marauder, I guess? No, you're going to move into the mineral field and just sit there. Yeah, now I'm curious. Now, no, it's still 12. Maybe it's something, uh, something's wrong with justice, I guess? Oh, well. Oh, well, what can you do? Uh, you. You're actually running way too hot to bother trying one of these. Uh, I guess we don't move you. You still have evasion. Let's have buckshot. Move all the way back here. Fire on you. 55%. Why? Oh, the, you're, you guys are now in the mineral field. Okay, that actually does make sense. Uh, I just do it. Okay. It's something. Alright, it is unsteady and its evasiveness is lost. It's going to fire on the archer, which is okay. I'm, I'm, I'm perfectly okay with that. Damage looks light, Commander. Yes. Yes, it does. You. Go right up here. Heading out. Cool down a little bit. We are getting to the end of this particular fight, so fire everything you got on it. Even with the 50% chance to hit, it's probably worth it. Or is it? You know what? No, it's not. Stay cool enough so that you can uh, still fire on the Battlemaster right after that. Oh, of course you missed your AC5. A little bit of damage. Nothing to write home about. Battlemaster, you're going to fire on the Archer as well. And I think with that, we're going to have to get the Archer back. Especially after all that nonsense. I just realized I'm ready for orders. Oh, did you just realize you didn't finish your story? Alright, you stay up here. 
90% chance to hit everybody. Hmm. I'm not sure who we should go for right now. Alright, go for the Clops first. Break that torso piece, please. No dice. No dice, and it gets to move again. It's going to fire on the Rodder. That's fine. It uses its breaching shot again, and then it moves Minimal back death. into the mineral field. Uh, you. Commander. You can't move up here. Oh, this thing is actually blocking our ability to go up here. Fasc Fascinating. Fascinating. I really wish that you could cool down, uh, but alas, you cannot. So you're going to go right here. Roger that. Fire everything on the clops. Uh, well, everything that you can. Oh, it's just that stuff. Okay, fine. Affirmative. Right torso destroyed at the very least. Side torso pilot injured. Order critical hit. Okay. Buckshot. No. Right Justice. What is your chance to hit here? Okay. All right. You're gonna go here. We need to disable this guy's weaponry. Right here. Still 12. Okay. Well, you're going to fire for this left torso. Try to break that thing down. Looks like we're not going to be salvaging this guy after all. Oh, well. I copy. All right. That thing should break off, and that should be a lot of its weaponry gun. There we go. Just two M lasers and an SRM, too. That's a bad loadout. Yes, Commander. Bad in the sense of uh, inefficient. You fire everything you got on the clops. Break the thing apart ASAP. There we go. CT destroyed. It would have been nice to salvage these I guys, but. Yeah. Go, go, go. Standing by. Especially with another lance coming once we get to the factory. I'm not uh, I'm not down for that. Too dangerous. All right, you guys get to go again before the battle master. Lovely, lovely. Okay, you fire again. Don't fire your M lasers, obviously, and just fire one. Yeah. Yeah, this thing's about to die. Marauder. Once again, I'm pretty sure you can't kill it or hit it in the head. Twelve percent still. Yeah, there's no point, is there? I mean, we could try, but even if we did, nothing we fire will. Yeah, we need two hits out of a 12% chance, two hits happening. So unlikely. Uh, don't fire that. Don't fire that. Oh, wait. Don't fire that. There you go. That's better. How are we looking here? Close. Provocator. Can you finish it? I don't know. But you're gonna try. Go right here. And don't fire one medium laser. That yeah, that should kill it. Got it. Down you go. Down you go. Look at all these pieces of mechs lying around everywhere. Beautiful. All right, everybody, start running towards the mech bay factory or mech fac battle mech factory. You know what I mean. Ah, uh, you. Uh, jump down, I guess. If we're gonna defend it. Next up. Hey, at least there's cover over here. Isn't that nice? You, go over here now. Uh, additional Capellan reinforcements have been spotted already. Interesting, interesting. Wait, why is it saying occupy the factory if additional Capellan reinforcements have been re have been sighted? I think we're fine. Stay away from the factory. Keep safe until the reinforcements have shown themselves. Pacify the area around the base. Where would that be? Can't see. Uh, who wants to scout? Archer, you stay back, you're damaged. Honestly, everybody's damaged. I don't know where those other reinforcements are. You move here. And then you move, let's say, here. Acknowledged. Hmm, I don't see enemies. Maybe they will only spawn after we get to the factory. Oh, never mind. Hello. Hello. Alrighty. Orion, you need to move back to where you came from. You. Uh, you can't identify anybody from here. Can you identify them from here? No. Not quite. What if you jump? Still no. Alright, you're going to reserve. Confirmed. These guys are going to start moving in. And we're going to reserve again. Hopefully somebody gets a little bit closer so that we can actually identify them. You might be close enough. Dragon. Standing by. 
not from here. What about from the edge of cover? Yes, to edge of cover. So what if you go up here? No. What if you go up here? Just off the edge. Oh, damn it. Fine. Fine, then go right here. Ah, oh, nope. Right here. Good. Roger. And sensor lock that thing down. It's a 90 tonner. It's another Klops. Okay, but it's not an HQ. Alrighty, well, Buckshot, begin the LRM spam at the Klops. 60%? What is this? What is this? Ah, 85. There we go. Just a little bit too far away. That's fine. And you are quickly running out of ammo, actually. Hmm, might need to change that up. Especially now that, uh, now we're at the point where we need to do more damage. Roger. Full speed. Maybe I should have brought the Thunderbolt after all, but it's too late now. You. Get up here. Stay up there. Brace. I wonder what tonnage. Okay, 75 tonnage. Damn, these are some heavy enemies. Uh, you. You know what? Let's reserve everybody again. Let's see if they uh, find us so that we can fire on them. Reserve again. See what they do. It appears to have been nothing. Okay, Dragon, identify the same exact mech. Wait, is that the other mech? Damn it! That's the victor. <laughs> My bad. Oh, and you're going to fire on the Marauder. Not going to do so well with it, but nonetheless. I'd be careful with your left arm, Marauder. Uh, you. Commander. Right of fire at its head, but I believe, once again, it's not going to really do anything for us. I copy. Decision strike, still 12%. Okay, well then. Looks like we won't be going for its brains, although, you know what, we could just try it. It would be nice to actually salvage something. No dice there, no dice there, no- Ah, one got in, one got in. Love it. You just need another one. My god, look at all that freaking oh, ammo. On that one. Uh, Provocator, you. you. You're not going to hit him in the head. But you can move up. Got it. You can also take a shot just because. Firing on target. Ah, damn. I was hoping that it would break that torso off with or and uh, get a crit on that uh, ammo bin, but oh well. You. You are rapidly running out of ammo. I would like that that uh, AC-20 gone, as it is kind of threatening. Should be good. Right, right. No, it's still alive. How much HP did that thing live with? Nine. And we got an Orion as well. Oh god, okay. Marauder, you're not gonna have a good time, little buddy. Dragon, at least you're going to be able to fire now. Go over here though. Get some distance. Moving to position. And then fire on the Victor as well. Focus fire the enemy. There we go. We got an ammo explosion, and its CT is fairly badly damaged. Taken a critical hit. Yes, it has. Oh man. Minimal damage on that hit. One more. Oh my God! They have another one. Damn. Okay. Well, I mean, I guess it is a four. Hmm. You go up here. You will have. A little bit of obscured protection, I think. I hope. Might be the best way to do it. But if you do, I'm willing to bet this guy's gonna move back right here and still be able to shoot you. But nonetheless. Nonetheless, try it. Go here. Try to hit it in the... You know what? Don't even try to hit it in the head. Everything on the CT, please. Just break that thing apart, please. 22 HP. Very close. Whoever fires next should be able to kill it. Okay, you're just gonna fire your long range. That's okay. That's not a big deal. My armor's getting stripped off. Yes, Commander. Provocator. Maybe you can Heading get out. one lucky shot with that AC. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No, it hit the leg. Of course, it hit the freaking leg. That hit something good. No, it didn't hit something good. Right here. Why do you lie? You lie like this. All right, you. Uh, you know what? Don't waste your shots, just fire one- oh wait, you only have 20 ammo left anyway. 
Hopefully you can finish this guy. Please don't cluster somewhere bad. There we go. At least the cluster in the CT. Let's do it. So much for the archer's ammo now. All right, Orion. How are we gonna deal with you? Oh my God! Structure explosive. You hit the arm. Damn it. Damn it. At least it's not. There's no expensive large lasers in there. Ready Fortunate for, for us, you. I guess we're going for this Orion. You still have ammo. Yeah, you have ammo for days. You're fine. You're fine. A pult. Oh God. So I should have targeted the pult first. Uh, sorry, Justice. I get that you're having a bad time today. Uh, you. Go right. Oh, man. You're gonna lose this arm if you do this. Go like this instead, then. Might lose the other arm. Precision strike, still 12, isn't it? There's no point. There's no point. Break the Orion, I suppose. You have a highest chance to hit him anyway. Don't fire. Go like that. Oh, you know what? Just cool and vent. Cool and vent and fire everything. I'd rather you do more damage. Since your uh, sniping isn't going to work out this time. Oh, you don't have called shot mastery, probably. That's why. I assume that's why. I never checked what Justice's uh, skills were at. God damn it, that must be why. Why did I forget about call shot mastery? Oh. Well, you come forward. Keep hitting Orion, please. There we go. A little bit of damage in that upper torso. Ooh, is that the AC-10 side? No, it's not, is it? Uh, there's ammo in there, and there's LRM-15, so that's not bad. Provocator, you. Can you fire everything? You can. You're basically out of ammo for the SRM-6s as well, which is a shame. On it. At least there goes that torso. You're not as threatening anymore, Orion. Still have an AC-10, of course, but... Hit, and then you move, move right here. There we go. Orion, you're going to fire. Oh my god. Yeah, well, at least it didn't break the arm. That, at least, we can be happy about. Uh, you. Do we keep firing on this guy, or do we switch targets now? We still have decent chances to hit your and Bulwark. Oh, you know what? Let's go for the Clops. Since you have such a high percent chance to hit it. There we go. Nice amount of damage there. You're going to fire back on the Archer. Yeah. As long as that thing is guarded, then it's a concern. Uh, you. Yes, Commander. Uh, do I want you to fire first? I think I want the Orion to fire. Yes, uh, yes. Orion, move right here. Stay in cover. You can only fire... Hmm. Alright, I think we switch targets to the Catapult. Leave the Orion with his AC-10. Because the Catapult is going to do a lot more damage. Although, how fast will we be able to bring you down? I do wonder. Probably not that fast. But we would... You know what, let's remove him as a threat. Alright, that arm is now damaged, but it only has a medium laser in it, so it's not that big of a deal. Cyclops probably going to keep going for the Marauder. Uh, yeah, Marauder is definitely going to be out of commission for a while after this battle. Especially if it keeps tanking. You. Yeah, we really needed some better mechs before we uh, we came around here looking for trouble. <laughs> but hey, it's still fun. Especially with the brawl kind of style of a play that I have. You. Commander. Hmm. Fire on this guy, I guess. Present your left side as best you can. Got it. Keep killing him. Uh, unless, of course, you can't fire much. That's about the only thing you can do. Oh, go for it. Oh, that hit a head. <laughs> Lucky headshot. That's fun. That's that's hilarious. Considering we wanted headshots before, but we couldn't quite get them. All right, we're gonna kill this guy via CT, I think. Uh, you. 
Do we get do we go for the Orion or do we You know what? Let's go for the Cyclops with you. You've been doing a good job. I'm damaging him. There we go. Keep damaging him. You're gonna hit the archer. Archer might have to move back soon as well. It's just about stripped of most of its armor. I'm We're going to ignore the catapult until the other two are dead, of course. Uh you. Stay where you are. You could fire everything on the clops. Or we could probably kill the Orion, especially if we precision strike. 18% chance to hit this head, but 82% chance to hit the torso. One ammo left on the AC5. If everything hits, it'll die. Let's hope. That's one CT hit. That's not. That's not. That is. Yes. Okay, good. Perfect. There we go. Now we are very rapidly running out of ammo on all of our ammo requiring guns. Hmm. I guess you're just going to move here. Ah, actually, I mean, it'll get you an evasion pip. Go for it. Copy that. You're gonna fire on the catapult. Okay. I guess he got angry that the catapult kept firing at him. That's kind of funny. You. Fire on... Let's see, you're pretty safe up here, I would like to hope. Yeah, let's let's uh let's do as much damage to this collapse as we can. The catapult is running pretty darn hot. So yeah, you fire these two oh man, you are not able to fire a lot of stuff. Two turns until you can cool down though. Alright, at least some structure exposed. Buckshot. Fire your four medium lasers. You'll say so. And we might have to, yeah, get you more ammo. Ooh, was that a head hit? No, it wasn't. Upper torso hit. Critical hit I got excited mind. for nothing. That's you. Fine. Go up here. If they fire on you, at least you have evasion. Got it. Break, uh, let's see. Can we break this guy's upper torso? Yes, we can. There we go. A little bit of damage. Reporting. Critical hit. Oh, there's blood in my cockpit. Well, technically the blood was in your cockpit already. In that you are already in the cockpit. I'm just saying. Ready for <laughs> I'm just saying. Alright, you. Uh keep hitting him in the CT, I guess. I oh, can't fire that, can't fire that, really. My god, you run hot. You know what we could do? We could move you up here. You'll be a little bit less safe. Especially if this guy decides he wants to melee you. But we're almost close enough to fire those uh, those small lasers. Oh my god, you actually managed to miss with your AC. You're gonna go for the catapult again. Okay. You really don't like him, do you? Well, let's keep killing that clops, shall we? Right Ew. Uh, just stay where you are, fire what you can, uh, just two lasers, I guess. You know what? You're going to cool down, fire everything instead. Yeah, this thing's already running way too hot. Ooh, you have a much higher chance to hit you, though. Why? The hell? <laughs> okay, why is this? This guy has more evasion. Is it the distance? If we move here... Oh, it's a distance, okay. Unfortunate. Well, I'd rather have the 80% chance, even if it's out of cover. The faster we destroy this guy, the better. Alright, ooh, that CT looks like it's breaking down quite rapidly. You, once again, move out of cover. On the move. Precision strike into the CT. Confirmed. I need to break it. Alright, whoever gets to hit him next should be able to kill it. Enemy turn? No, it's our turn. Dragon. You've been doing this a lot. Precision strike. I know it doesn't really work with missiles. Oh, man. You can't use everything. But try it anyway. Kill it, kill it. Yes, okay. Down goes this clops. Now we just have this guy. He's going to do a lot of damage to us. Uh, you're gonna lose your arm. 
Oh, no. Very close to it, but no. Surprised. Okay, you. Start moving up. Ah, uh, you can actually fire from here, can't you? Yeah, you can fire from here. You're fine. You're fine. Cool yourself down, please. And begin the attack with devil lasers. Ah, uh, wait. Precision strike? What do we got here? 74, 12. I don't really care about salvaging you. Let's just go everything for the CT. Ah, oh, no, that'll reduce our uh, bonus from Resolve. Let's not do that, then. Ah, most of that hit the CT anyway. Pretty happy. Next, please. You. Move it on up. Right here. Minus one M laser. There we go. Two into the CT. I love it. Huh. Or was one into the, uh, one was into the cockpit, or into the, uh, head, whatever. Position. Fire everything you got as well. Uh, no, we still can't precision strike. We could have if I had moved you last, but of course I did not do that. Dragon. Ready for orders. You. Damn, you need to move so that your shot isn't obscured. Over here. Yes. Engaging jump jet. And then fire mine. Oh damn! Just fire the one LRM-15, I guess. Everybody's running hot. This guy's gonna move next. He's gonna melee. Oh damn it! You're gonna lose something. Nope. I'm doomed. Probably not a good idea, Mister. Uh, you do just as much melee damage. Do it. I'd rather you work it. Uh, nice, nice. Did that hit the CT? No, it doesn't look like it. Huh. If he wants to play that game, I'm perfectly willing to. You, move in here. Once again, you're going to... This time, you are going to precision strike the CT. Ah, it's not worth it. Not worth it with this many weapons. It's not going to kill it anyway. Huh. Will this destroy the torso piece? Yes, it will. Alright, well, this guy's a lot less threatening now. Well... Some heavy damage. Considering he's been meleeing people, uh, you you could punch him, or you could do four damage, or yeah, don't bother. Just precision strike that CT. Roger that. A little bit of extra damage, and down he goes. There's the dropship. We don't even need to occupy this, really. Does it just end, or do we actually have to occupy this base? No, we do have to occupy it. All right, well, move it in, move it in. Move it in. And hopefully, you... Jumping. Hopefully there won't be another Lance. I wouldn't think so. The factory's under control, Commander. Davian forces are setting up defenses. Good work. There we mission go. Mission successful. successful. Ooh, hard little mission. Hard little mission. We are a little bit under strength for this sort of thing. Alright. Alright, a little bit of, I mean, the injuries hurt. 14 days, 14 days apiece. We might not even be able to do the next one. We did get a decent amount of salvage, however. We will take a piece of Victor. And a piece of... Hmm. Battlemaster. Oh, we could finish the Awesome as well. And we could finish another Orion. Damn it. <laughs> what do we do? I don't really care about the Cyclops' Q that much, either. Yeah. Some nice, uh, nice salvage over here as well. Oh, damn, there's a plus three energy TTS. That's kind of rare. Hmm. Okay, fine. No Victor. We'll take... Oh, did it move all the way back up? Fine. Take one TTS. Battlemaster... Cyclops, Cyclops. I guess we won't finish the Awesome or the Orion. But it's not like we're super reliant on it anyway. Yeah, and we have plenty of laser vomit hot running mechs right now, so whatever. Uh, let's see what we got out of that. Yeah, we didn't get the Awesome piece or the Orion piece. I'd rather have the Cyclops pieces. It can output a lot of damage. More importantly, it can tank a lot of damage. Which is what we're really, really lacking in this Let's Play right now. We may be able to tank better. Alright, so with that, I believe I'm going to call this episode here. There's not enough time to do another battle, that's for sure. I am, however, going to quickly go into the uh, mech bay to find out how much damage we actually took, how long it's going to take to repair, but more importantly, how much money it's going to cost to repair. I would imagine it's not that much. Uh, mech repairs, yeah, thanks, buddy. 
Let's just check this out for a sec. Let's see, Marauder, you took... Yeah, one day, that's fine. And... Archer, one day, it's fine. Okay, no, basically no cost, and yeah, we're fine. We're fine, everything's fine. Uh, what is not fine, however, is the fact that our elite mech warriors, or our, even our relatively elite mech warriors, are all gone. And Justice, yes indeed, you didn't have called shot mastery, which is why you only got 12% instead of 35. I messed that up horribly. I should have used... Literally, wait. Who can? Who does have it? Dragon has it. Buckshot does not have it. So only Dragon and Provocator could have used that mech. Damn. And now, Dragon and Provocator. Hmm. Anyway, I have to think about whether we go into the next contract here or we just head towards the uh, towards the next flashpoint because. I'm not entirely sure we could capture another base with the pilots that we have. Although, I do like the risky plays, so I gotta think about it. Anyway, with that said, as always, I do appreciate any and all feedback with regards to the gameplay or the way I do things on this channel. If you have a second, please do take to leave a like and or a comment to support the channel. It really, really does help. As always, all glory to the algorithm, and thanks for watching.